Today in the Bronx, a judge has made what many would consider a stunning decision by overturning a jury's verdict in the conviction of a man found guilty of sexual assault. People hate people like you. Trevor Hemlock was facing 20 years in prison, but is now free to live in a neighborhood just blocks from the families of the children he allegedly victimized. I'm the victim here. I was set up, brutalized, and humiliated. So tell me, how do you get these kids to go with you? I'm curious, you know. Want it? You're going over the line. Do you understand that? People hate me. I don't hate these kids. I love them. They're my friends. Supreme Court Judge Barry Creighton overturned the jury's conviction of Hemlock of brutally sodomizing and sexually abusing three young children during separate occasions last summer. Hemlock has a long history of sexual abuse and investigations dating back nearly 15 years. In his decision, Judge Creighton ruled that Hemlock's written confession was found to be inadmissible after the defense attorney presented the judge with a shocking video taken at the time of Hemlock's arrest. Defense argued that the video evidence indicates how Hemlock was severely beaten while in police custody by the arresting officer, Detective Jack Probetti. Probetti violated my client's constitutional rights. He's a disgrace to the American judicial system. And I personally, and you could quote me, We'll have him arrested and imprisoned. I'm sorry about what happened with you. I really am. I did the right thing. I did what had to be done. What do you mean sending me this? What's that big idea? Bring your guts down here. We have a good explanation for this, officer. I prayed for five minutes with you, man. And now I got it. Detective, how do you feel about what happened today? They just released the monster.